Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna have a little something different. We're gonna be talking about a little bit of bike maintenance and that is cleaning your air filter if you have an aftermarket one for your Harley Davidson. Let's get right to it. So on my 2018 Sport Glide, I have a Arlen Ness Big Sucker and it has a cotton air filter with, it, it's a black element so we're going to be cleaning that in today's video and we're also going to be showing you the whole process of how to clean it, recharge it, get it ready and get it road ready. So step number one, take off your air filter. Once you get that air filter off, you want to shake it to get all that loose dirt, bugs, whatever that's been caught in your air filter since you've been riding or put it on, you know, for the first time. So go ahead, do that. And then what you want to do next is you want to run some cold water, not high pressure, just a little drizzling cold water and make sure you wash from the inside out. That way you're not trapping all that debris and stuff back into the filter, rather making it go out from the inside out. Next, you wanna go ahead and clean your element with some cleaner. I use the Arlen Ness filter cleaner. Just start from the inside, go out, spray it from all parts of the air filter element, get it nice and diluted, be liberal with it, and then you're gonna let it sit for about 10 minutes and soak. After the 10 minutes, what you wanna do is you wanna go ahead and rinse, do the same thing. Start from the inside and go ahead and rinse to the outside. Rinse all the way around once you're done with the inside, get it nice, get everything cleaned out until the water runs clean. And it's also a good idea if you're gonna have your air cleaner off overnight, if you're drying it, go ahead and cover up your intake, that way dust, dirt, debris doesn't get into there overnight. Now once your air filter is all clean, what you want to do is you want it to air dry. I recommend setting it out in the sun for a couple hours. That'll kind of speed up the process, especially if you got a hot day like it is today. Set out in the sun a couple hours, it should be good. Now the last step of this whole thing is you have to get it re-oiled. This is a cotton filter. It's reusable several times as long as you take care of it. I would say if there's any bugs in there and it looks really dirty, go ahead and do it if you're on long trips. You may want to take, take a, a charging kit with you, go ahead and get it recharged. That way you've got nothing but clean airflow going into your intake. Because that's the most important thing about this whole thing is keeping your air filter clean, especially if it's exposed to the elements. Because the less air that your engine can intake, the poorer the performance is going to be. So to keep your engine running tip top, clean it as often as possible as you think. Now, you, like I said, you can use these things over and over again. So. Cleaning it is not a problem if you do it more often than, than just once a year. So you got a nice dry air filter. Go ahead and carefully squeeze a light application of your filter oil along the outside surface of the filter, applying sparingly with restraint. Do not over oil during this process. You can get drippy oil in there and that can get in your intake and that's no bueno. Just don't be too liberal with it, but in this case, you know, it's a little harder to tell if you have good coverage because we got the black element and I'm using a clear oil. So just make sure you go all the way around. And what you wanna do next is you wanna let that oil seep in and wick into the cotton of the air filter. And you wanna do that for about 20 minutes. Okay, and after that 20 minutes, you know, a lot of this has been just a bunch of waiting, but after that 20 minutes, you could just reinstall it back on the bike and you're good to go for a ride. You are clear, pretty easy maintenance to do that's also very important for your motorcycle well guys that's all i got for today's video thank you for spending time on this channel once again if you liked today's video if you thought it was helpful please give me a thumbs up i'd really appreciate it subscribe to the d cycle channel if you haven't yet hit that bell icon when you do that way you know i got videos out just like this one until next time you guys enjoy your day enjoy every mile get out there and ride